So the other day I was talking to this guy, right? Yeah, he's, yeah, yeah. He's, te- he's telling me that he's like working on this like thing that you can like, like smoke weed like underwater. Oh, brother, brother, no, underwater? I don't know how it works, but like we gotta look into that. Oh my God! Oh Jesus Christmas, bro! That would be phenomenal. That would be like. Un- like that's taking it to unnecessary levels, fam. But like, imagine what you could do with that, fam. Oh, that would be insane. You, your mom's got a pool, right? My mom's got a pool, bro. You could get under there, and yeah. then I just don't know how it's gonna work, cause like, you gotta get the fire. For you the need bomb. the fire, right, right, right. Well, they got that plan. Like, there's probably like waterproof fire, right? Oh, I would think so. You'd have to have it, yeah. It's gotta be somewhere. I don't know. Okay. All right, Damien. So I was doing my nightly sky watch last night at the park when I heard this crazy noise. It was like, I looked down at my computer because thought maybe a video started playing or something, but there was nothing. There was nothing. Then I noticed a sound was coming from the forest. So I grabbed my camera. I ran into the forest. As I ran, the sound got louder and louder and louder. And then bam, I exploded out the other side of the forest and I saw it. A real UFO, I couldn't believe my eyes. I was so excited, my shaky hands almost dropped my Polaroid. But I didn't, I didn't. I looked up at the sky and I snapped this photo. What the hell's so great about that photo anyway? What's what you get about it, man? This is a photo of an actual UFO. This ain't no Loch Ness silhouette, it's the real deal. Come on. Yeah, this is a dope picture. But I wish you could've been there to confirm you weren't just tripping out. (laughs) Tripping out, man. This is our ticket to fame, man. It's our ticket to fame. I like where you're going with this. Joint's ready. You guys again? God, how many times do I have to tell you? Study rooms are for studying, not your silly hobby, all right? And don't think I didn't see that. Hey, man, okay, you may think it's a silly hobby, all right? But... I got a photo of an actual UFO here, man. Yeah, actual my ass. It's probably fake anyway. No, man, that's that's genuine. That's the real deal, all right? And I took it. I see a strange line here that doesn't match the background, all right? I'm sure this UFO can be found anywhere on the internet. Fire outline? Can I see it again? Hey, hey, man. Shh. You're not helping. You're not helping. There's a there's a, there's a fine outline because I took it with a quality camera, all right? And you can find it. You can't find it all over the internet, all right? You won't be able to. Search everywhere. It's the real deal. Do you really think anyone's gonna believe this? I mean, think about how many fake UFOs there are out there. How are you gonna prove this? We, we could take it to a, we could take it to a scientist to look at it, or we could maybe I- Travis, stop, stop, stop. Listen to yourself, man. I'm concerned for the both of you. I mean, look what it's done to you. You're staying up all night looking at the sky. Your grades have dropped and you're doing drugs. You know what people think about you? This little hobby of yours is hurting you. You both have great potential to do things. Yet you sit here fixating about something as real as Bigfoot. I mean, come on. I expect a lot better from you. The both of you. All right, man, let's, let's, let's get out of here. Yeah, man, we don't need to take this shit. Man, I thought I'd never get to have this. Man, it's for Mr. Rich talking down to us like that. I don't know, man. Maybe Mr. Rich is right on this one. What the fuck, dude? You listen to that guy? You said we'd make it big. How? All right? How? All we've done is waste time and effort, and nobody's gonna believe us anyways. Okay? Really? Yeah. All right, let's go then.
Just two stoner kids. The situation has been dealt with.